back to my channel. We are doing a Timu haul. Can you believe it? Um, some camera mount problems, but you know, we're gonna work through it. I figure we are going to do a front facing video this time because um, it's a Timu haul and I need to be looking at my price list to give you guys my prices. Um, and I actually put makeup on today for a meeting at work. So we're going to go ahead and get into the haul now. <clears throat> Before I do, I have to rant about a Dollar Tree purchase. I went by Dollar Tree because I needed, well, our Dollar Tree nearby is like the family dollar and Dollar Tree little combo situation. So I needed coffee and stuff like that. I saw this on an end cap and it's six by six paper. And if you can see, it's spring themed, right? So disappointing. Again, that's what it's supposed to look like. And that's what it is. So not only is it not spring themed, it's actually like nothing but dark prints. To say I was bummed is an understatement. I hope that no one else gets duped like that because these were really cute papers. And yeah, totally bummed. I'll use it, but I'm not happy about it because it looks an awful lot like a Prima collection that I already have. So anyway, um, the other thing I got recently, I bought it on eBay is from an art journal thing. I went ahead and copied Patty and on eBay I got um, like there's a store that I follow and they basically do probably like palette cleanouts or something so stuff that they sell like they sell a lot of media um, and if it's new it could be a damaged product so this one the little spirals are a little wonky and then it has a gouge in the back. So I got it for a great discount. But I wanted this size. Because um, maybe, hopefully, I'll continue this next year if Patty does it again. And then I have another journal to do. Um, yeah, so we got that. Got a couple things from Goodwill for $0.69. Cents. I got some gold sticker butterflies. Really cute. Not a whole lot lately thrifting, but I did grab this for $1.99. I got rid of all of my, um, it's still juicy too. I got rid of all of my stamp colors, except the two that I use the most, but I got rid of all of my Tim Holtz stamps, inks, I mean. So, yeah. Okay. Timu. That's what we're here for, right? So, a Timu haul. Um, I got some things that aren't craft related, so we're going to go through that first. This is a storage bag. I need to put our winter clothes away. And this thing is honking. Like, I mean, it's at least probably three foot long, tall, whatever. It says it holds 40 kilograms of clothes. And I paid $4.49 for it. It was supposed to be a freebie, but I didn't check out in time. Because, you know, if you're on Timu, then your cart is completely full. And you got to go and pick what you actually are going to purchase in that order. So I didn't get the freebie. Um, but totally worth the $4.49 for some clothes storage. I also got um, a grocery sack storage bag. This is actually for my son. He um, has his own place and you open up his cabinets under his sink and it's just a sea of grocery sacks and I couldn't stand it so I bought him that. That was 59 cents. And this is a toilet brush. It's a really slim toilet brush. We are um, well, long story short, we're finishing the downstairs here, the, the half basement, and we're putting the bathroom in, and, um, 
you know, we're probably going to move down there, but eventually it might serve another purpose for my father-in-law um, when he gets older. So that's the plan, Stan. So I went ahead and grabbed that because it was $2.58, and I thought, hey, that's going to be a good deal for downstairs bathroom. I don't know. Timu makes you buy impulsive things, like completely impulsive. So the next stuff we're going to talk about is Stanley tumblers. And I'll preface this by saying I only have one Stanley. I don't plan on getting any more. I would never stand in a line and wait on Stanleys. I might get one for the summer because the one I'm going to show you that um, I have is black. Um, my company gave us a personalized Stanley for Christmas with our Christmas bonus. But on Timu, I decided to get some replacement straws and these are just like clear glitter. And it even has the little um, cleaning brush, but they're too short. They are too short for the Stanley. So we're just gonna put them in the kitchen and use them. Um, the other little thing I got was, okay, so those straws were 224. This is a little charm, and it just has my initial on it in silver. They do have these in all different colors, but I got silver, and you'll see why. Um, so the little H's were $1.98, and you get two. So see, I already need to get another Stanley. Um, I needed straw covers, so I got a pack of three. It has a white one a gray one and a black one that's already on my cup and these were $2.69 I got a little black and pink heart one this one was 98 cents I got a plain pink one um, for 44 cents and this one was my fave it's a pumpkin for $1.16 and then I also got a boot. The cup boot was $1.48. So that's the little cup boot. And it's just silicone. So it's red and black. And then there's the little charm on my cup. And my straw cover. So that's my little, that's my little Stanley. So we're gonna take a drink real quick. I would never pay that much for a Stanley, but it does keep your ice in ice form for two days. So, all right, on to crafty stuff. I got a little package of quote stickers. And guys, if you like quotes, these are hands down awesome. Um, these were $2.11. Uh, I don't remember if it says how many are in here. But it has uh, short poetry, it has Winnie the Pooh, it has song lyrics. I mean, this is so good. I highly recommend this. And they're the perfect size. So they're like that, and like that, and sometimes memories sneak out of my eyes and roll down my cheeks. Let's find a good one. For every minute you're angry, you lose 60 seconds of happiness. I mean, they are just so good. To love her was to inhale her existence. Peter, or Christopher Poindexter. Really good. So, those get a 10 star from me. And last, we have some stamps, because I am trying to build my stamp collection back up, because I got rid of everything. And, you know, that always happens, right? So, I got stamps, and let me see if I can... Hold up, okay. I have a piece of notebook paper here, so hopefully we'll be able to see them. Um, I got the crows... They look like that. These were a dollar fifty-two. I got the little 
four cats. These were $1.52. I got this neat moon set. And that one was two eleven. Okay, so those were really cool. Then I got some oddball inspired stamps. These $1.52. They look like that. Again, another oddball inspired stamp. This is a birthday stamp because I didn't have anything for birthdays. $1.52. We got the Three Sisters inspired stamp for Halloween. I love the faceless stamps. Um, this one was $1.86. We got just a plain, like, lines and doodles and borders basically that one was a dollar 78 love this one it's the little houses and it's all one stamp but i was thinking you could probably if you don't want all of them or you could just stamp them all and then cut them and not cut your stamp i don't recommend that <laughs> that's what i was gonna say but no Let's don't do that. $1.52. Um, let's see. I got some shrooms. I love some shrooms. $1.52. I got another moon. Love that. $1.52. Now I need a stamp block because I got rid of those two. I got rid of my stamp platform. These. I don't know if you're going to be able to see this. Yeah, you can. The little heart blooms. Uh, $1.69 and the piece de la resistance was the rabbit I thought that was really cute so the rabbit was $1.78 that is my little Timu haul the cart is already full ready to go just waiting on some money to hit my account so that I can make another purchase I try to do $20 or $30 every now and then um, Currently, it's probably my cart's at like $200, so I chip away at it. All right, so that's everything from this haul. I'm going to get started and put everything away. I hope you guys have a great day. Much love.